GT here to play some street, us for street storm, and today we'll be um completing or starting the actual street series. I was thinking that about um yesterday in a video. So um first before we do so, we always do the daily trials when I get on. You know what I'm saying when these events come out, this is the biggest part of the game. The events are very important in my opinion. I usually do these events first because they they give you a lot of money and I give me time to upgrade my cars. And I want to max out my advantage for the exclusive races. So hopefully I could do so today. But one thing I'm going to let you guys know, I will be watching a lot of the ads in, in the street series to multiply my money. So if you get like 12,000, multiply by two, you get a lot more money than we got before. It's going to be very important because the reason why we're doing this is because it allows us to have enough money to actually max out some of my cars. That actually, I have a Civic. During the, the pink slip race yesterday, I still have a Civic, but I didn't want to lose my Venture because that's the only expensive car I had. In my garage, so and I think he lost. Yeah, we took an L, took a bit L, very big L right here. Try this again. There you go, we got it now. Got it down and ready. Don't worry about these ads. I don't know if this ads come. Okay. Yep. Yeah, thank you. Um, I've been playing the game a lot. I'm trying to grind the game as much as possible. I like you guys to really see. Okay, I play a, this game. I mean, a lot. That was false start. Hey, when that happens, it happens a couple times with me, especially on snow. Oh, that was easy. Daily events are always easy. Street series are very annoying. I'm, I'm telling you, it's a pain in the butt. I just, the fact that street series are so painful and they're so hard at the same time. Like, when you get further into races, it's like, it's like, it's crazy how hard they are. Alright, so today we started off with Mercedes AMG GT3. And we're going to continue from here. Look at the cash money we're getting. Look at that. There's literally so many money. Look at that. That's a good amount. There's literally, I'm literally, that's a, that's a good amount of money. So. I told guys to stop because I thought um launched too early. I didn't want to get a false start, so Oh god. Alright, let's try again. Yep, that's good that, that was gonna happen, I told you guys already. It's gonna happen. Once in a while. A little bit of lag. Spring drops. So this is the reason why I hate this here because you have to really get the launch off the line okay if you don't you're not gonna guarantee the win. It's like that you gotta stay off the line because we both had the same amount of stats. 
So if you're gonna take the L, you gotta make sure you're ready in first. Actually, I don't think you really need a double reward because you're only doubling your actual like. All right, now we're moving on to some nice little letter. And let's car model you want it. You own in the Freedom Frame Run First Form Street Series. Take your skills with it. And blah blah. Okay, I'm just rapping. Right, the phone is lagging again. Oh my god, I hear that. This is what I have to do every day, guys. Just lag. Complete lag. Frame drops and everything. Even though I'm running low settings. There you go, we got it. Vents are very quick, uh, they're very short, they're very short, and we probably could get three done in today, because we get a good amount. We get a good amount done today, we get a large amount done today, actually, in the video. Um, but, um, subscribe if you're new, like if you're new, okay, you know, we out here to be, to watch my videos, if you guys are interested to see other games, and eventually see more let me know type what game you want to see i will be getting my, my parts supply soon from my xbox so yeah definitely be seeing some more call of duty back on the channel and so on actually world war 2 for example but i don't know what you guys want to see if you guys don't want to upload war 2 or whatever call of duty or whatever then i i, I don't have to what's up you guys i'm gonna this the channel focus on cars that's why that's what i love and that's why i, I want to be i want to be an automobile engineer bro so the channel was mostly supposed to be made around cars but i just wanted to add a call of duty because i'm still young so it's like it's not really much i could just it's not really a lot, a lot of games until the crew to come out you're gonna be see a lot of content in that i mean a lot I mean, so much you see the crew too on my channel, probably the entire time until so I can just take a break and switch it up a little bit. We managed to hold him off by an inch of a, of a splitter. Okay, that was luck, complete luck. So right now we have 608 diamonds, 80,000 cash, we're about to be 110,000 cash. We are going to max out, I'm guarantee you, we're not going to be able to max out the vented because how expensive the parts are. They're like 30,000 for the A, plus A, B, and C class parts. And it's pretty dumb how expensive they are. It's kind of stupid because you don't make that much money in the game. You know? really see here because not i wish if, you, if you're able to repeat events i'd be like yeah it's possible but you can't really say that they can't really repeat events in the game if it's possible yeah i'm able to make a good ton of money right now that's what i prefer to do the series and save money up from that point because it's easier for me to actually max out my cars this way now i messed up again Alright, so we lost that game. We lost our race. AMGs. Sounds amazing. Twin by Turbo V8. Ah, uh, I did it again. I did it again. By Turbo is a twin turbo, guys. So. One thing about Mercedes, their exhaust notes are very, 
insanely sounding good. I I mean, they probably Jaguar actually always had a good sounding too, but Mercedes wise, no. Mercedes would destroy Jaguar any day. In terms of sound wise, because I don't know, the sounds are so the, the note of the exhaust brings out the car so much. You're it's a lot explained, but it's very intricate and very different from other cars. Where the exhaust notes are way different. Oh man. This guy I'm telling you, this this is a frustrating race. This is what I have to do with sometimes I usually take a break and go on to the next section. But we're gonna actually complete the time for you guys. I won't be able to make it come right now. Maybe if the nitrous earlier, let me try that. I don't know what works because using these events is all about timing and release, release time and I hate the fact you get a launch before you go. Let's try that. If I could just launch before him, I'll be able to win it. And I hate that what happens. That's what happens all the time. I'm trying to figure out why couldn't it make the game this work like a dragon game. Like it makes it so much difficult to actually get a perfect launch or a right launch. So you're gonna launch before me and everything. Oh man, struggle. Yeah, but this game is very fun, but in my opinion, if they never added this system where you have to long, you could long before to go, it would be much easier to actually win races because you don't know about mistiming whatever. I mean, you don't know when it'll actually launch a car most of the time. Or no, Wendy's not just specifically because it's so weird. <laughs> And we lost again. Guy loves him, right? Alright guys, we're gonna switch it up a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and move on to the next section. And wanna come back to it later. This is the way I I used to do just to uh, actually just get away from the race because usually this is way more effective in doing so. Okay, it doesn't stress you out too much. Because usually when it happens, I don't like to keep doing the races over again. And it gets on get give me a very bad headache. Right, so I, I'm just gonna just move on to 370Z, VQ37, the Nismo actually. And this one says a really good looking car. VQ37 is an amazing engine. VQ35 was probably my favorite engine from 350Z, because 350Z was one probably one of the best looking version in my opinion, because the 370 kind of removed that that wide feel to the car it's not the same no more it's not like the feeling that we had before it's just kind of weird to say uh snap but at the same time you think about it it's cars and I like for something that it does not have that wide look to it anymore as it did in 350 I really enjoy I enjoy this game very much um the sounds sound very good they're very accurate they're better than some of the games actually on console which I'm kind of like no that's, that's very sad 
And a lot of Android games have horrible, horrible, um, sounds. I mean, they're not even accurate enough to say, like, they're horrible. Very badly. Now, here you go with Ticket L again. Some, these are some of the things I feel the game needs to be, like, really updated on. Is the new this launching system, they need to fix that, and was rock with the normal launching system. I think we'll do better that way. But, um, also, is that you should be able to unequip parts and, like, put on different cars, transfer parts, uh, on the gloves and stuff. Because once you equip them, you can't unequip them or you put on our cars. It's kind of dumb, you know what I'm saying? And, like, I understand that. But at the same time, we want it for all the cars. Like, you want it for the first specific car. And pull past me. Oh, my God, dude. See, I'm doing the lag right now. And frame drops. Don't know why. Now we got it now. I'm not really winning. Not that. I'm two, two times in one. But like, we like actually went to about to shake it up a little bit, but um. Yeah, my phone battery about to die. So we're gonna do it from my phone, and we're gonna keep going on to these events. Claim these twenty-five diamonds. Okay. Um. Probably reason why. I'm, okay, that's a lot more races than I thought. Um, let's continue on this one. I don't feel like doing that. One thing I know about these. Um. Like very good cars, you're gonna get good rewards from them, and also it's gonna be shorter because you're getting a large amount of good rewards. Unlike the very lower end cars, you're in the street series, you're gonna not gonna get very good rewards, but you're gonna get more races to benefit you as like as these type of cars in the street series. See, I'm just doing frame drop right now, and I can't do it no more. I'm low key feel like just deleting freaking CSR on my phone. Alright, what we're gonna do, guys, I'm going to quickly go in and uninstall a quick game, real quick, to reduce the lag I have in this game. That's the reason I'm losing right now, because lag is such a big deal in a lot of games. And I'm running low graphics already, so it's like, okay, um, shouldn't be losing here. Alright, let's quickly do that, real quick. You guys might see this on the screen, so don't worry about that. It's gonna be something a little small. CSR Racing 2. You gotta go it's right now. Install you later. Not right now. Next, you know, be honest, I don't even play NBA Live that much anymore, so I'm just gonna uninstall it because this this ticket with a lot of space. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Um, and then we have yeah, that's about it, and. To make sure I just reduce my lag I have in general. I'm going to my files. Oh, we're good now. Actually, we're good. Make sure I do the robot no more lag. For great. Okay. Alright. 
go back into the game and see what we do. This time we should be good. Whenever my normal lag, <coughs> we should be good now. All right, there you go. If my phone loads up real quickly, maybe yeah, it'll work out. Wow, screen went completely.